What up, my dance babes? Welcome back to another video with your girl, HBCU Dance Teams. If that is something that you are interested in, make sure you like this video up, throw a comment down below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. So guys, we have a lot of topics to get in today. First topic I want to get into is Christiana. I wasn't sure on my last video if Christiana was um, a part of Elkhorn. But a lot of people have been telling me she made the team and that was just 19 on the picture that I posted on my video. I appreciate everyone that had come down below and let me know that she did make the actual team. So thank you for that. Um, also, make sure you guys drill a comment down below and congratulate Christiana. I am glad that she is a part of Alcon's, um dance team this season because... We didn't really get to see a lot of Christiana last season. So hopefully this season we get to see that silent killer really, really blossom. On to the next topic. So um, they have this fame on tour for that's going around. Um, it's going to be Taneria. It's going to be Jordan. And it's also going to be this girl named Ayana. So the tour is going to be held on June the 14th, the 15th, and the 16th. And it's going to be located in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. So if you guys want any more information about that, make sure you go check it out on all of their pages. So a little bit about Taneria. If you guys don't know, Taneria was a golden blue. All of those young ladies were golden blue, but Teneria was actually a golden blue before she became a dancing, y'all. So I'm kind of glad that Teneria is doing this tour because she, Teneria specializes in jazz. And I'm going to put a video in here for you guys to see how she danced and what she's going to bring to this tour. So next we have Jordan. If you guys don't know who Jordan is, she is a golden blue. She been a golden blue. I remember one season. I don't know exactly what season it was, but I think it was like 2015, 2015, 2016 season when Jordan, um, she had tried out for the Dancing Dolls. And I think she made it, but she didn't want to be a part of the Dancing Dolls. It was a picture roaming around. I would have to see if I could find that picture. I would definitely post it on my community page. But um, she do more of like lyrical, a lot of lyrical. And she also do like a lot of contemporary dancing. But Jordan is a great dancer and she have amazing technique amazing so i know she's gonna kill this class i actually went to one of her classes and i really really enjoyed it she's a great teacher and she's great at what she do so i'm excited for her for this tour next we have ayana ayana is also a uh, um golden blue i don't know exactly how long ayana been a golden blue but i do know she is one of the top dogs on the Golden Blue. Like, she's been on there for a while now. And I I don't know if she graduated or not. Don't quote me on that. But, yeah, she is a Golden Blue, and she will be there also. So, guys, we're going to get into this next topic. I hear that Stingettes are having tryouts. For the next season, man, I am excited to see what the Stingettes are going to bring next season. Because I do feel like this season was very rocky for them. Not because of, like, um, 
like they're dancing but i do feel like since covid 19 is prevalent right now in our society in our world it kind of just It kind of just messed everything up. I feel like we didn't really get to see a lot of HBCU dance teams do their thing. I mean, I did see one uh, HBCU dance team, which is all kind. They really, like, kind of put themselves out there. And they did a lot of things. They didn't really let COVID stop them. But I do know Dancing Dolls. We only saw, what, like, one or two games for them with Jada and then with this thing is i mean we saw games but i feel like it didn't really bring a lot i feel like brie did her thing she did enough but i feel like i wanted more you know in my opinion again this is my opinion and i do feel like she should have brought a little bit more i do feel like also they were very small like these young ladies are very small i'm used to this thing as being like grown women you know like this video is 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 they're big, they're grown, they're sexy. I'm not saying that this thing is not aren't sexy, but it just they just had grown, grown women. Like they look grown. I'm just saying, you know. So yeah, man, I'm excited about this new season that's coming up. And I hope that everyone that tryouts, I wish them the best of luck. And we will see who's gonna be captain. I'm excited for that. So comment down below, guys. Tell me how you feel about this video. This is the end of the video. Make sure you like this video up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I love you guys and cannot wait to see you guys on the next video. Peace.